What do we call as a dead relationship? When we cannot relate. Hmm? Yet the person is in front of you. So apparently, technically, you are there with the person. Yet you clearly call it a dead relationship. When do you call it a dead relationship? Not related with any of events in past. What do you mean by What do you mean by not relate? Means, मेरा कोई दोस्त नहीं है, relative नहीं है, so I say कि ये no, there is this fellow right in front of me, right? And I am saying it is a dead relationship. What do I mean by that? There is no emotion, you know, that we both are sharing. And he is bothered with his presence. Hmm. Speak more on that. I mean, his presence makes no difference. But why? He is there, and he is all right. Why does it present? Why does his presence make no difference to me? There is certain closeness to his. Uh, I mean, I'm close to the whole image. I am close to hmm. um, the the platform on which I see him or listen to him is so full that I. There is nothing that can be put on it. Hmm. Uh, things are extremely predictable. So, reactive. either that could be there that he is coming from my past, and I already have has to. an idea about him, an image about it him. Has to. Yeah. Or it could be so that I do not know him at all. Yet I cannot relate to him. Even in that case, it's a dead relationship. Even in that case, I do not know him, but he is sitting next to me, and he exists. As if he is not there at all. No, even now it's a dead relationship. Why is it a dead relationship? Even in the second one, you know him. You know him as a stranger. Yeah, I do not know you. So in the second case, again there is an image. I am preoccupied with something else, and again there is an image that he is not a part of my plan. He is not a part of my mental process, which is happening right now. So he is unimportant. Hmm. This is a dead relationship, where what is is unimportant, something else is important. So, what is a dead flow? That my attention is somewhere else, and uh, that's it. A preoccupied flow is a dead flow. That's it. Okay. See, just as in terms of space. we have relationship with people similarly in terms of time we have relationship with past and future what is the right relationship that we have with people present when do i say that i can have a right relationship with somebody when i can pay attention For that, I have to first be deeply grounded in my self. Hmm. I have to be deeply with myself, and then there can be a loving relationship between me and anybody else. Right. Similarly, to have the right relationship with past or future, I have to be deeply grounded. Yeah. then my relationship with past and future is all right see just as in terms of space we depend upon other people for the fulfillment of our desires don't we my <coughs> son will bring me such laurels my wife will fulfill my desires my boss will give me what i want so what is it depending on other depending on other what for people for getting my desires fulfillment mm -hmm. i do not have it within me so i am depending on <laughs> others to give it to me i do not have it within me so i am depending on others there is a sense of incompleteness something wrong and i am depending on others to provide it to me this is in terms of space people, space people 
Similarly, when I say that the future will give it to me, the process is exactly the same. Time. Just that instead of uh, people, it's not time. So, so I'm again not with me. Again not with me. Now, what is the right way of dealing with a person? Yes, you are wonderful, you are beautiful, but I'm not dependent upon you. That exactly is the way you deal with the future also. We have no enmity with the future. It's not that future is something evil. Just as others are not evil, future too is not evil. But future becomes dangerous when used as an escape from Otherwise, future is alright. Just as others are alright. Just as others are alright, future is also alright. You remember in our calendar, there is one this thing that seated firmly in the present. Seated firmly in the present, past and future are good jokes. Good harmless jokes. So they are good fun. Just as when you are seated deeply within yourself, Others are wonderful. The entire world is wonderful. Hmm? Like that duality is good as long as uh, the person is sitting. You said that the space and time was good. The space was also good. The other thing is that the time is related to the time. Like in the space, mein, the other will fulfill the desire. That other exists because there is a there, there is a time that has been spent with the person. So these two are always related. It's always space-time.